Yo, yo, hello. Hi, Killzone, how are you doing? I hope you're doing well. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I am here. Uh, let's switch over to the full screen. Hi! <laughs> I'm gonna be using the 3D model today. Hopefully the, the new updated one, um, will come out soon. <laughs> I, I think we're, we're getting even closer, so I'm excited. <laughs> excited to mess around with that baby, and then we'll be able to do so many awesome things <laughs> on VC face and you guys might be able to throw stuff at me. I'm excited. Um, but yeah, I hope everyone's doing well today. We're gonna play some more Mass Effect. Uh, I apologize for not streaming yesterday, obviously. Um, I was just busy with work, so, you know. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I'm happy, happy to be here as always. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and get it switched over here. Uh, let's see. Let me unmute Mass Effect. That would be a good idea. Probably move myself a little bit. Thank you for the host kills, though. And we'll see if it captures. Oh, wait, I need to stop that. <laughs> Oh, there's interesting music in here. I was like, what am I playing? Oh. <laughs> so I was doing some stuff uh, off stream and you know, I believe we're right at the entrance of a side quest where um, this crazy, uh, this crazy biotic man has basically cre created a cult, I think. And he's killed Alliance members, uh, so we're gonna try to either kill him or talk him down. I, <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. Oh, Burnout Paradise is fantastic. I love that. I played a shit ton of it, uh, two years ago, I think? Because <laughs> I never had it originally, I think. Yeah, I don't think I ever had it, but yeah, it's really good. <laughs> There he is! I am Major Kyle. I know why you've come. We have no quarrel with you. Why can't you just leave us alone? Hmm. Where are the what investigators? What happened to those other Alliance officers? The ones who came before me? They wanted to take me away from here. They wanted me to abandon this place. Turn my back on my family. Your spoke family. blasphemy. I did what I could to make their end quick and painless. Oof. I had no other choice. It was necessary to protect my children. <laughs> oh my god, you're safe. creepy. <laughs> I don't like this guy. Uh... Oh yeah, that's totally fair. That's totally fair. Um... Uh, let's see. The Alliance sent me to bring you in, Major. Can't you see this has gotten out of hand? Don't you understand you are endangering your followers? I respect that you have come under a banner of peace, but I cannot do as you ask. If you take away their father, my children will be helpless. Oh god, I hate this guy. This guy's so creepy. You ordered your followers to kill those Ugh. Alliance investigators. You must face the consequences of your actions. Do you really want your children to suffer for your sins too? No. This... this was my fault. My children are innocent. Pure. Please. I never meant for this to happen. Wow. I, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> damn. <laughs> I'm really surprised that uh, he's like, oh, okay. Come with me, Major. It's over. Wait, if my children see you taking me away, they won't understand. They will attack and you will be forced to kill them all. You have shown me the error of my ways, Commander. Now you must give me time to explain it to them. It is the only way they Ooh. will understand. Please, give me one hour. After that, I will meet the Alliance authorities at the gates of my compound and surrender without violence. I give you my word. Ooh, I'm not sure I trust I think you. I it would be better <laughs> if you came with me now, Major. I must do everything I can to keep any more of my children from suffering. This is the only solution. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, man. Um... I... <laughs> Alright. 
I'm gonna trust you. If you betray that trust, you and all your children will suffer. I will not betray you, Commander. Thank you for this. Uh -huh. Your pilot can ask Alliance Command to send a patrol to collect Major Kyle. I just hope you know what you are doing, Shepard. Ah, uh, me too, man. Notify Alliance of Kyle's surrender. I want to dispatch his ship. Oh my god. I, <laughs> I, I think he's just gonna escape. I don't think he's gonna... <laughs> Oh god. But uh, I'm playing as Hala and I, I think she would she would go for it. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna go well though. Explosive rounds. Better better freaking hold up to your word, Kyle. I swear. Got this uh, Mountain Dew watermelon flavor. It's really good. I can't really have too much of it, obviously, but <laughs> it's really tasty and I'm going to wait for it to go flat. Or I'm going to try to anyway. <laughs> I might just end up drinking it and get sick anyway, but you know, whatever. It's really fucking tasty. There's also like a new flavor of fucking Pepsi. I'll probably pick that up tomorrow. I don't know what it is, but it says it has three different flavors mixed in. I think they're going for uh, America Red, White, and Blue. <laughs> I thought it was going to be Blueberry, honestly, when I looked at it, because it looks just like a blue soft drink, you know? But... I don't know. I guess I'll see that tomorrow. <laughs> Alright, going back on the ship. Uh, so I have to send out a... How do I do that? Like a, a party to pick them up. Right. Let me look at my journal, because I don't want him to go free. Oh, I found Rex's family armor. I have to talk to Rex, okay. Oh yeah, I also, uh, when I was playing, they brought up Cerberus, uh, which will come into play later in the series, um, but this is the first mention of Cerber Cerberus. Uh, Kalku has given you the coordinates to a research facility run by the Cerberus group. You need to investigate the planet Binthu to find out why Cerberus is unleashing alien monstrosities in the Atakin Traverse. Uh, let's see, here we go, Major Kyle. Return to Normandy. I don't know how it needs to be informed. Okay, so Hackett needs to be informed. You are Presley. Do I talk to you? Yes, Commander. Uh, Carry on. No? Yes, okay. ma'am. I need to talk to Hackett. Do I have to go all the way back to the Citadel for Hackett? Do it need. Talk to Joker. Commander, something you need? Uh, no. I have to go. All right, see you. It says return to the Normandy and talk to Hackett. But I'm pretty sure Hackett is at the Citadel, right? So that's Presley, Galaxy Map. Ash is watching me play right now. <laughs> uh, where is Hackett? You would think I would be able to have like a direct line to these people or something. It's Chaka Chakwas. I need to go talk to Rex anyway. Hey, I found your family's armor on a random planet. I don't know if you give a shit or anything. <laughs> I kind of look like I could be a suspect either. Oh, this is how you equip everyone. Ah, uh, okay. 
What do you want, Shepard? Uh, found something of yours. I found this armor. Does it belong to you? Let me see. Yeah. This is it. Hard to believe my ancestors wore this piece of crap. But at least it's back where it belongs. Yeah. Thanks, Shepard. Yeah, no problem, dog. I might be starting to like you after all. Oh, cool. <laughs> He's happy. Just because I like you doesn't mean I would kill you. Oh, okay. <laughs> He, he would still kill us, okay. That's fine. Something funny happened in Aryo's stream. Uh, someone basically donated 300 and gave everyone a gifted sub. And it was after Aryo and B Horizon Zero Dawn for the sound of voice, he almost cried. Oh, so that, okay, yeah, because I got a sub too, actually, from that. Oh, that's so nice. Heck yeah. I'll have to, like, go and watch that stream or something. I'm so happy for him. That's so nice. <laughs> oh, I don't need to talk to you. Cause yeah, I, I noticed earlier that I got a, I got a sub for uh, his channel <laughs> or their channel, excuse me. Heck yeah! <laughs> they deserve it. They deserve it. That's fantastic. I'll have to look in the Discord too. Okay, uh, I, I don't see where we go to fucking talk to Hackett, so I'm gonna go to the Citadel. Message coming in. Oh wait, is this it? Patching it through. Admiral Hackett here, Commander. Oh, it is. Okay. Your Sorry, Ash is right in front of me. I can't read the text. <laughs> we sent in a team as you instructed. Kyle's followers have disbanded, <laughs> and the major surrendered to us without incident. We'll make sure he gets the help he needs. To oh, honest, yeah, he actually, this thing was gonna end in a bloodbath. He actually uh, surrendered. You did it, but you saved a lot of lives. Congratulations. I know. Cool, I did it, and I saved a lot of lives. <laughs> all right, so that's everything there. I was just going through like all the fucking systems and shit. Because why not? I can't. The only thing that sucks is I can't really tell where I've been and where I haven't been. Like, <laughs> that's the only thing. We'll go to Kepler. Newton! Give Ash some pets. Message coming in. Oh, no message. Patching it through. I've received some troubling information, Commander. We need your help. Someone yeah. is killing former Alliance scientists. There have been four deaths in the past month. Damn! Yeah, what did they work four on? Scientists. Sounds like someone has a project they'd like to keep secret. All four scientists worked what? on classified you want in my project lap? Macuz. No. There was a brutal massacre lap? there years ago. An entire oh. unit was okay. killed by Thresher Maws. Oh boy, Thresher Maws. It was classified as a natural hazard, but the project dates coincide with the attacks. Suspicious. That can't be a coincidence. There was one other scientist on the project, Dr. Wayne. I'm transmitting his last known coordinates. Good luck. Fleet out. I think Fifth Fleet is the fleet based around Earth. I don't know if they're at Earth, but I think they're based around Earth or something. They're closer to Earth than I am. <laughs> okay, this must be it right here. Uh, Liara, because we still need her. And I'll take care of this. Some combat strength. And... Landing! Alright. What do we have? So I, I also figured out that uh, there are some like secret hidden things. Ooh, ram! Um, no, 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 no. <laughs> Thank you for the ram. Um, there's like some secret hidden things on the map that don't always pop up. But I'm not gonna fucking search around everything. <laughs> Let's see, what does the ram taste like today? Well, I mean, it tastes like watermelon Mountain Dew. <laughs> Which is delicious. God, I- man, if I could still drink fucking carbonated drinks, like, I would be all over Mountain Dew. 
Sprite. I fucking... Sprite was my favorite. Well, actually, no. Root Beer was my favorite. And then Sprite was my second favorite. And then, uh... I think, like, Mountain Dew would be my third. And then probably Coke. And after that, it doesn't matter. Oh, oh, and then, uh, like, Orange Fanta. Orange Fanta's probably... Number one as well, or something. Or number two, at least. Ew. Is this shit? Oh, that's right, I need to be on level terrain. Got it. Here we go. Terrain corpse, recover! Yeah. God, I must have, like, a shit ton of money. I think about every system has at least one planet you can get on. Oh, you don't like Mountain Dew? That's yo, that's totally fair. I I don't know why I like Mountain Dew so much, honestly. I have no idea. Oh, there's people walking up to my house right now. Not gonna answer my dude. Anyway, um, yeah, I, I just, I, I love that shit. <laughs> I think probably my favorite of the ones that I've had is probably a live wire. I mean, it's been years. Like, I had live wire when it first fucking came out. Um, same with Code Red. <laughs> Code Red was really good, too. <laughs> I just really like Mountain Dew. <laughs> I just wish I could drink it. But I guess it's kind of good that I can't, because otherwise I would be gaining weight from all the sugar, so... Hey, that's something. <laughs> I, I'd rather just drink my water and my tea and shit, so... Sometimes my mixed fucking sugar drinks. Salvage. Some weapon upgrades. And then... Underground facility. Looks like there's enemies there. out quite a bit i i think i like i don't know it's like in the ground weird because yeah look at that <laughs> i touch it it's just like oh <laughs> i'm vibrating <laughs> all right another underground facility i'm gonna take my weapon out looks like we have a uh... is that yeah that's a human Got some dead humans. They might be mercenaries, though. Oh, let me save <laughs> before I die in combat or something. And then I have to look at the whole planet again. <gasps> Stop! Stop! You violated the law. <laughs> Pay the court a fine or serve your sentence. Pay your the fine, all of you. Kinsley! Then pay with your blood! <laughs> Thank you for the raid. <laughs> Please smoosh Garrus for me? Oh, hell yeah. A hundred percent. Don't worry. We'll get on that. Actually, is Garrus with me? Yeah, oh, there he is. Hey, Garrus. Hey. Hey. Oh, come here. Mwah. Oh, he's a little shy right now, you know, he's on camera, he knows. He's just a little shy. But yeah, hello, thank you so much for that raid. I hope you had a fantastic stream, welcome in everybody. Soup. Uh, oh god. Rogans? Oh boy. Here we go. 
I'm gonna throw you. <laughs> I love little shy man. Oh my god, they are coming up my ass. Oh! <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. They are aggressive. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Ah. Hopefully my face will be upgraded soon, actually. Um, I don't know when, but hopefully soon. Oh my god, there are so many enemies. Ah, uh, Krogan. Oh god, I'm gonna die. Nice! Thank you for the follows, I appreciate it. Yes, I am Miss Bashful Face. I'm sorry, uh, if the game is too loud, uh, just let me know. Just, yeah, it probably... It, it, it might be. <laughs> it's difficult with this game. Let me uh, actually go into options real quick. Okay, um, let me lower these a bit. But yeah, I'm Miss Bashful Face. Um... Hi, <laughs> I'm a pro gen with a bashful face. <laughs> um, I don't always use a 3D model. Sometimes I use a 2D model. And this one is going to get updated soon uh, because the creator is going to update the model package. So then I get to work with that and it's going to be super awesome. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait. Then I can actually have expressions and stuff and possibly use the Tifa program. Oh, thank you. Oh, looks like my bitrate just dropped. I think we're good, though. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. Burnout Paradise just finished downloading. Oh, OK, cool. Also, thank you for that 3D model ping. You can get this model on a uh, Gumroad. It's going to get updated pretty soon. And then obviously, you can edit it how you want. I added the horn myself. Okay, is everyone dead? Because that was... wow, that was a whole lot <laughs> right off the bat. There we go. Shotgun, assault rifle, sniper. Also, this is not my first playthrough of Mass Effect. Uh, I've played the series quite a bit. But I'm just happy to be back. <sighs> there we go, headshot. Toxic headshot. Perimeter clear. Ooh. Uh, some more stuff. And now that I have Burnout Paradise, I'm gonna get Guns N' Roses Paradise City stuck in my head. Yup! <laughs> That's how it works with that game. Come on down to Paradise City where the, uh, uh, the girls are pretty. Hey! Hey, hey, there you go. I <laughs> I don't know the lyrics. <laughs> oh, there's a floating thing in here. What is that? Oh, okay. Anyway, uh, looks like our story beat is back here. Stay back. I've got no grief with you. Please. All I want is this back. He's a madman. He's a madman. You're insane. You need help. It's Corporal! Corporal Tombs! You don't get I, to lie! I think Not he today. might be insane. Today it all comes out! Uh... <laughs> what's going on? What are you talking about? Why do you want to kill this man? Want? What I want is uh, my Also, life let back. me know what you guys want me to do with this situation. I want to go to sleep without screaming in my dreams! I want the people who sent me to Akuz brought to justice! Can't you see that Tombs is crazy? Uh, Shoot him! What have you been doing to this man? But if I can't get that, I'll have to settle for killing the men who took my life. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, we could talk to him, we could shoot him, uh, let me know what you guys want. We were on a coos. When the Thresher Maws hit, my entire unit was wiped out. The Thresher Maws, the scientists were studying them. They let them hit our unit just to watch. Oh. I woke up in a holding cell. The scientists were delighted I'd survived. 
Now they had someone to run tests on. Uh. What do you what mean? What kind of tests are we talking about? You can't believe Tombs. He doesn't have any proof. I demand a fair trial. I mean, you don't have Ever any proof right now either. Acid in your veins? I have. They wanted to see what it would do. They're part of some organization, Cerberus, that runs secret tests like this. They treated me. I mean, the fact he knows the name Cerberus means this that it's probably justice. legit. This man deserves to die. At so least I think. I, I don't remember how this goes, by the way. <laughs> and it looks like I can't. I don't have enough points to do uh, Paragon or Renegade. Um, but he did mention Cerberus, which I don't think a whole lot of people know quite yet in the, this universe. And I wouldn't be surprised if they were doing these kind of tests, because they're doing tests- oh, look at that spinning thing again. <laughs> they were doing tests uh, in another location that we still have to investigate. So honestly, I'm kind of believing this guy. Um, <laughs> so, oh god, uh... So all we can do is we can shoot this guy, or we can let him shoot the scientist, or maybe try and talk to him to make it go public. Uh... I'm gonna see this. I can arrest him. He'll answer for his crimes in court. Weren't you listening? He was part of a secret organization. He was? I don't know what Cerberus is, but they'll never let their operation become public. This oh. is the only way. Are you helping me or are you killing me? <laughs> okay, are we are we shooting him or are we kill this scientist? Honestly, I believe this guy more than the scientist. Um, just because this guy is talking about Cerberus. <laughs> Fuck it, do it, do it. What you're saying is true, then pull that trigger. I won't stop you. Mr. Toombs, please! We had no choice! We had no choice. They had to die. You get it, right? I had no choice. But it's okay now. Uh, is it? Now the scientists are just like my unit. No survivors. Uh. Oh. Uh. Oh. Tombs' corpse slumps to the floor, his face pinched with rage just a few moments ago, appears peaceful. You resolve the situation in his own way. You salute the corporal's body. He deserves that at least and turn to leave. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, there's that. Oh, okay. Yup. So, I guess. Wait, why is there still a thing here? Um, it was Cerberus? I think I. There's still something I need to uh, investigate in here. The other pathway I didn't take. Yikes. Big old yikes. But, uh, yep. <laughs> that happened. I need to just go through the doors before the fucking mission marker from now on. I didn't expect it to kick me out like that. What? I can't go this way. Ah! Was there something in here? I see an alien. Oh. <laughs> that doesn't do anything. What? I do the Palpatine thing. Yeah. Do it. <laughs> I get. Yeah, cause like we we were like. Yes, give in to your anger. Shoot him. <laughs> so yeah, I guess we're Palpatine now? Does that mean I have unlimited electrical power? I hope so. So I don't really want to charge anymore, you know? Angie! <laughs> Poppin', hello, how are you doing? Good to see ya. Hello. I wave with my big hand. <laughs> Oh, you got first for Soto? Nice. Pseudo, excuse me. Their emotes are really good. Alright. 
I don't know why there's still a marker there. And I think we got everything else. Besides this over here. How are you doing? But the way... Oh, the wave looks janky to me? Yes. <laughs> That's because it is right now. <laughs> it's, uh... It's obviously not fucking, um... Uh, sized correctly next to my 3D model. Also, I was having trouble, uh, anima a animating it. Blah. I still need to, uh, figure out the program a little more. It is a lot smoother now. It actually runs at a full 30 FPS. Versus before, where it ran at, like, 20. But... Yeah, I'm still figuring that out. <laughs> Alright, uh... Because with Vegas, for me to, like, animate something in Vegas, a PNG file, or any image file, um, I have to... Message coming in. Patching oh. it through. I reviewed your report on the situation, Commander. It's unfortunate both the Doctor and Tombs died, but I know you did your best under the circumstances. Thank you again for your assistance. Um... Sorry, there's just a lot happening outside my house, and I'm very confused. <laughs> anyway, um... What was I gonna say? Oh, it... The way you rotate things in Vegas is not... I don't know, it doesn't make full sense to me quite yet. I just need to figure it out. It's really weird. Apartment inspection this morning, so now that it's over I can finally just relax. Oh yeah. Yeah, I, I, I've had a- I've had, um, like, rent- like, house inspections before. We were renting a house. That was always fun. <laughs> I was only there for like a few of them, but it was stressful. Message from the brass at Arcturus. Patching it through. Because you never know what they could ding you with. Admiral you know, like if they're just in a bad mood, they'll ding you with some bullshit. In the Skillian Verge, surveillance drones have identified Geth outposts on four different planets in the Armstrong cluster. Oh wow! We need someone to take them out. We have any idea what they're after? Hard to say. They may be just gathering intel on us. Or maybe they're setting up staging grounds for hit-and-run attacks on human colonies. I'm on it, Admiral. Fighting right. Saren is still your top priority. But you've got experience fighting the Geth. You're the logical choice to take out these outposts. Or outposts in this system, that's ridiculous. We're transmitting all the locations of known Geth outposts in the Armstrong cluster to- Yeah. Uh, let's go to Vamshi first. Oh, the game! There it goes. Commander, urgent message from Alliance Command. Shepard, this is Admiral. We've got a situation here, and you're the only one that can handle it. What's wrong what this time? Admiral? There's an Alliance training ground where we test weapons and technology and live fire simulations. Okay. One of the VIs we use to simulate oh, enemy no. tactics in the drills. Is no longer responding to our. Oh, the VI has gone rogue. Has gone rogue. You should have known better. No, we trust. We trust robots. Just tell me how to stop it, Admiral. We need you to fight your way through the training. We trust the robots VI here. Okay. And manually disable it. <laughs> manually disable it. Can't you disable it remotely? Our fail safes aren't responding. Was that weird thing the Normandy zip passed? Uh, that is a um, relay. Systems, but we don't have any direct access to its process. It allows ships um, to. I, I don't know if it, it does. It's not before. teleporting. Someone it's like some light speed travel, but move really quickly throughout here. the solar system. You're still part of the Alliance military. And right now, Edie? <laughs> Toa, hello. Slip space? I have no idea. <laughs> I'd have to read up on the, the, uh, the codex, honestly. But yeah, it, uh, it's a part of the Prothean technology that was left behind that like everyone else found and now used to traverse our galaxy. Um, uh, same with the Citadel. The Citadel is not 
the creation of any species currently living. They're made. It's ma it was made by the Protheans, and they're all dead. So yeah, it, it, <laughs> we're using their technology uh, because it's there, and we're not exactly fully sure how it works, uh, but it works, and it allows us to do a lot. So we're kind of just. Uh, Using it, and hopefully nothing bad will happen because of it. <clears throat> Hold on, let me look at the other map before I check that. Yes, we, we must always trust VI, AI, all those eyes. Right? I mean, I think I'm an AI, right? You trust me? Bruh. <laughs> I'm so confused. There's like so much Sweet. fucking happening outside my house right now. Like, did my neighbor's fucking kitchen sink blow Hello up there. or some shit? I don't. Hello there. Hello there. I'm so... <laughs> just like, there's a car just sitting out there and then another guy pulled up. I don't- I don't know what's happening. Pradith, hello! How are you doing? <laughs> okay, I'm right here, so let's go up here. This is the Geth outpost. That we have to take out. Oh! Multiple Obi-Wan? Wait, what? It's a bit broken? What? <laughs> Wait, did multiples pop up? Here, let me- let me ding it again. Oh, there- Hello there. Oh! Hello there. Whoa! Hello there. What the? Oh, I know what it is! Oh, hold on. Hold on. I have it on loop, probably, because I was doing stuff. There we go. Okay. That- that should be fine now. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's because, uh, the animation was on loop. That's my bad. I- I was testing or, uh, moving Love stuff it. around the other day. <laughs> capture the game. Why does it take so long to capture this goddamn thing? Marcus, hello! Good to see ya! Come on, capture the game. What are you doing? <laughs> Just feeling really friendly today. I mean, it is Obi-Wan. He is, he is a good fellow. Also, hello, Prinny. My game isn't capturing now. Hold on. Let me reset it. Maybe? Wait, did it just crash? No. OBS? You gonna... You gonna capture? OBS? No? What What the fuck? God damn. Why? Why are you doing this? OBS, please. <laughs> okay. Okay. Bruh. Let me just uh, save and restart, I guess. Oh no! It popped up right when I closed it! God damn it, OBS! Fuck you! <laughs> damn it, dude! <laughs> what the fuck, OBS? All right, let me restart it. God damn it, I just noticed it. I, ah. <laughs> oh my God. Fucking. <laughs> of course.
<laughs> Streaming! I'm a professional. Granted, this isn't my fault. This is the software. I swear. It's not my fault, okay? <laughs> Alright, it's booted back up. Are you gonna capture it, OBS? There we go. Round of applause for OBS. Thank you. <laughs> God damn, dude. I don't know why it took that long to get a hook on it. I reset it twice. Ugh. <laughs> the B in OBS stands for bra. Open bra software. At least it loaded up quick though. Open bra software. Of course the uh oh wait it looks like it's over here. God, they're already shooting at me. I was gonna say, of course the Geth outpost is up on a mountain. Cause they just have to make it difficult. We got a level up. I'm sure we'll probably fight some Geth Colossus at their uh, their base. Me level up. Encryption. Alright, um... Uh, I'll just fucking max out your sniper, my dude. And what is this, just ultimate shield boost? Yeah. Um... Damping is good. I'll just grab that. Wait, did I? I? I didn't do the whole party, did I? No, I did. Okay. We're being jammed! Can't see the enemy. Oh god. Wow, there's, uh, there's a lot of them here. Let me hit you, please. Thank you. Whoa! <laughs> Alright! <laughs> I wasn't expecting that! Three more outposts to go. Nice! The first step in a long journey. Okay. <laughs> Not know that was gonna happen. Spaceballs now for some reason? That's exactly what I was thinking of. <laughs> the printer is jammed! <laughs> the printer is full of jam. Oh, and the radar dish. That's what it was. I thought it was a printer. That's right. <laughs> Our signal is jammed! <laughs> You vertical mountains. Just need to get over there. 
hello my baby scene from that movie stuck in my head i don't think i remember that one too well the the scene i remember the most from that movie is when they're combing the desert <laughs> i love that so much we ain't seen shit <laughs> made that man a gunner. I don't remember that. Cross the planet we go. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna be 100% in this game. Like, I love this game, but it's all these, like, minor things that you have to traverse each and every planet for. The blue one is a neutron star, right? I can't remember. I used to know all that shit. Now I don't. <laughs> it's been a while since I've been in a uh, astronomy class. Cool, cool. Also, I need- I think I want to do something- not that- well, this Friday I'm gonna be playing uh, some games with Bear, but next Friday, um, or Saturday, I don't know. Well, maybe not Saturday, actually. I think he has a tournament. I- I don't know. But, uh, when I'm done with work, which my final day is next Friday, um, I want to do something special stream-wise, but I don't know what I should do. It's like, well, I could do another, like, community smash tournament, but I don't know. I don't know what I should do. <laughs> I feel like I, I want it to be community-based, but besides smash, I, I don't... I don't really have anything or any ideas, honestly. Oh, cool, thank you. <laughs> I'll definitely check that out later. Comedy movies that I think a lot about. Spaceballs and, um... Oh god, I don't remember the name of it. Uh... Fuck, I don't remember the name. <laughs> it's a, uh, it's an older one. Fuck. I, oh, well, I mean, there's Robin Hood Men in Tights. It's the other one that's, uh, Cowboys in the Desert. I, I can't remember. Cowboys. There's a lot of uh, racism in it. <laughs> but they play it off like super well. Fuck. Uh, Broken Saddle? Was that it? Oh, I don't know. That might be it. Something like A uh, Mel Gibson movie. <laughs> Rest in peace. Alright, I think that's everything here. Yeah. Got one of the Geth bases. Yo, Devil's Cry, what's up? How are you doing? I think I don't think it was called Broken Saddle. I don't know what I'm trying to Been trying to play this, but <laughs> Final Fantasy XIV has you in its clutches. I can't blame you, though. Like, honestly, that... The stuff that dropped out of the, um... 
recent fucking fan fest. Very interesting. <laughs> the Reaper looks kind of fucking cool. So does uh, the male bunnies. I, I actually considered, I was like, ah, should I play more Final Fantasy XIV? Because, like, I'm not going to have a job in a week. So, you know. <laughs> I could I could play it, but I need to spend my time doing other shit. I don't know if I if it's if it's good that I get into an MMO right now. Can't wait for the Reaper class. Uh, yeah, it looks really cool. It's really fucking. Take a slight break before the the, g <laughs> the game got addicting again. Right, right. What happened with the job? Oh, I quit. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna try and get into a new field. I'm gonna get into, a uh, game QA. Cause I'm just fucking fed up! And I finally found something that at least I'm slightly interested in, so... Pole? Pole? Wait, what? Pole for what? <laughs> that answers my question, then. A poll for what? I'm confused. Oh, you mean a poll for what to do? But the only idea I have is Smash. Like, I don't have any other ideas. Because it would be cool if I did, like, a big stream. You know? Because I'll be fucking full-time streaming in a few weeks. And celebrate me quitting my fucking job. <laughs> and spend more time on stream. I, I just, I don't know, besides fucking Smash, what I would do. And I don't think I could survive eight hours of Smash, to be honest. Or even six hours. <gasps> I really wish I had Mario Kart 8, because that seems like a perfect fucking game, but I don't, so... <sighs> I mean, technically I have it. I have it on Wii U, but... Odd. Just go over! How do you not have Mario Kart? I don't know. I, every time, like, we see it, we're like, Oh, Mario Kart! Do we want to drop 60 bucks on it right now? <laughs> no? Okay. Yeah, I know. It's pretty much one of the quintessential games on Switch, but... Oh, we don't have it. And there was that sale not too long ago, but... I was probably not looking to buy anything at that time. Yeah. Well, when <laughs> Mario Kart 8 originally came out, it was like, oh, you know, like they do with every other system, they'll just release a new Mario Kart with the new system that comes out. <laughs> oh, nope. <laughs> Man, that didn't happen. I thought this was the Geth base. I guess not. Yeah, Geth Outpost. What the fuck? Or wait. I'm on the Mummified Slarian. Okay, we have to go to the Geth Outpost. <laughs> Hello, Fen! Oh yeah, Mario Kart 8 is fucking fantastic, but do I want to spend fucking... What? What is it now? 50 bucks on it? Not really. I've already completed the game to almost 100% completion. Like, <laughs> do I want to do it again? Not really. But it is really good for streams. Eventually, maybe. I'll get it. The Switch Tropical Freeze, yeah. That was one that I waited for. Um, I still haven't played it. That's another one I would like to pick up at some point. These fucking mountains. Just because of convenience, yeah. The Switch is such a wonderful convenience machine. Alright, here we go. Somewhere. Where is it? Oh, I see it.
Like, I'm... Uh, eventually, I'm also gonna rebuy uh, Final Fantasy XII on the Switch. <laughs> Just so I can fucking have it on the go, because good god, the Switch is so good for that. By on the go, I mean uh, take it downstairs and watch TV downstairs with it. <laughs> Colossal's gonna probably drop. I'll just sit right here. Here he comes! Oh, he's... oh! Okay. Why would I get out of my... Fucking Mako, like. <laughs> Why? When I can just do this. I do love the new HUD, yes. So far, I've really liked everything about this. Oh, hi! I haven't had any crashing issues, and I mean, it has its visual bugs, but it always has, you know. Nothing has broken. No, we're halfway there. Halfway there, wow. There we go. Alright. Let's go over here. <laughs> Mako or Marco. Or Polo. <laughs> I did, um, actually, so I might, I can't really make any plans because I don't remember what fucking Bear is doing this weekend, but, um, Friday I'll probably be playing games with him, and then maybe Saturday I'll do a Miitopia stream, because that's when that's dropping, and I probably won't get it in time to actually stream it on Friday, maybe, and then, um, I guess we'll play that next week too. up there. <laughs> it's just some minerals. I don't give a shit. Beat Saber? Oh. I still need to look to see if uh, Beat Saber's website is still afflicted by a Trojan or not. Um, I need to look into that. But that is a good idea, actually. That is a very good idea. Because I haven't heard any updates on if Beat Saber, if they fix that. <laughs> so, I'll look into it. Or VR chat, another good idea. I forget that I have VR occasionally. And then I have to update it too, because the game updated, um, so that'll break all my mods. So I have to reset up everything. something to the right. I don't know what that is. I would say a thresher, but I don't know why a thresher would already be on my scanner. Yeah. The updates are tiny. Yeah, I know, but they fucking break all the mods. Last I read, though, it should just be... I should just have to update the mods that I have, but I have to double-check, because there's... It takes so many mods to get that running on stream. <laughs> and running how I want it to, like, oh my fucking god. <laughs> I have to micromanage all that shit. Yeah, I'll look into that. All right. 
wait. Oh ho! Did you look at that? No surprise. Oh, will you just die? There we go. Gotta take care of these armatures. Here we go. What is this? Oh, there, yeah. There's also the multiplayer mod. Fuck. Yeah, I have to. I have to see if I can do that. Or not the mod, but you know, whatever. That that might get more difficult though, because I think people have to have the same mods installed for multiplayer for it to work properly. Ah, oh, god. <laughs> Hello, Aaron. How are you doing? All right. I hope you're doing well. Got two new five star characters in Genshin. Oh, nice! Heck yeah! I downloaded the update and uh, that's all I've done. <laughs> I think I've got everything in this cluster. Did my controller disconnect? No. Oh, okay. That was weird. The B button just wasn't working. A lot to do in the game again. Well, that's good. Speaking of Genshin Impact, I was, um, I was listening to, I think it was the Game Informer podcast where they went into it quite a bit, but, um, Scarlet Nexus. Um, God, what did they say? I think they, they made some comparison to Genshin Impact, or was that, no, that was, that was, fa that was Fantasy Star Online, uh, 2 new Genesis or whatever the fuck the game. That wasn't Scarlet Nexus, never mind. <laughs> Scarlet Nexus sounds very interesting though, honestly. <laughs> That's really all I have to say about it. It sounds interesting. They said uh that the characters are seem fleshed out in the uh, preview preview they got. That there's gonna be what two storylines with the male and female. It sounds really cool. The gameplay looks really fucking cool. Like it just looks cool. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to get it on release though. <laughs> so eventually I would like to play it. But I don't know about release. Something about Genshin having characters Japanese voice doing suggestive moaning for climbing? Yes, yes, we did. We did. And we watched it live on stream. <laughs> no, but I was thinking of uh, Fantasy Star Online 2 New Genesis. Um, apparently how that, that game is working is, is that it's an open world, kind of like Breath of the Wild or Genshin Impact, and then you enter um, like cocoons or towers to level up your character. And they're, uh, like, they're like the fucking dungeons in Genshin Impact. Where they're basically like a trial that you have to pass to get skill points and whatnot. Which, I don't know how I feel about that, but, I mean, hey, I'll fucking try it out when it's not on the Windows Store anymore. Old Thresher. Oh, he's coming after me.
Where you going, Thresher? Ah, oh, damn it. Beat up. No, that's fine. Dragon, hello. Uh, Lisa's voice actress played Lisa. Did a whole lot more interesting voices than she does in the game. <laughs> yeah. Geth and a mummified biotic creature. Oh. Ve the vehicle and the human corpses show the telltale signs of Geth weapon fire. Uh, the Geth have been mangled by the thrush Thresher Maw, at least they got what's coming to them. How are you doing, Drackle? Why did the Ma Mako originally get crap when ME1 first came out? Uh, because it sucks. <laughs> uh, I'm playing- actually, can I switch the control scheme on it? Yeah, the Mako action is horribly boring. Mako! So, I'm gonna turn this off and then we will have how the Mako used to be, I'm pretty sure. Right? So, now the Mako uh, doesn't move with the camera movement. Like, if I'm, if I'm pointing forward, it doesn't move forward. I think that's the only change they made to it. It's a welcome change, though. So now, no matter which way I'm going, uh, if I hold forward, the Mako will move that direction. Thank you for the host! Dracon. Good? Hell yeah. But yeah, this Mako shit gets horribly boring, because, god, there's so much of it. Prothean Ruin. Alright, we got a day to the disc. And there's just some debris here. There's a Geth outpost. Alright. Gotta get that Geth outpost, so. It's fun when just driving to mission locations, so there's scripted events like Geth dropships, but exploring planets driving around for 50 hours- yeah! <laughs> if you go across the whole system- oh my god. Uh, which is basically what I'm doing right now. <laughs> just going to every fucking planet you can. Yes, I have a 2D and a 3D rig. <laughs> And soon, this one is going to get an update, which I'm very excited for. Thank you, Killzone. The, uh, the new update will hopefully allow me to be able to actually use emotions, uh, like, so I can actually be, like, sad or mad or whatever. And then it should also work with, uh, the Tifa program. So that way I can uh, have you guys throw stuff at my face on stream. <laughs> Saves points. <laughs> yeah, I'm just waiting for that update to go through and then I'll start working on that. Alright, looks like it's north, so... The throwing stuff at my face will be fairly cheap, honestly. Um, it'll be, like, 500 points or lower. Because it is a fun little thing. Oh, I should probably, um, repair my Mako real quick <laughs> before we go in.
This way the bosses can't hit me. There we go. Hello, Colossus. Good to see you. You're looking fantastic today. <laughs> What's that? You don't know I'm here? Oh no. How horrible. Alright, they're dropping in. You're at 42.9k. Nice. Thank you for all the support. Oh, wow, that's a lot. Alright. Just gonna run you over a little bit. Just one more outpost left. Okay. I think that's it on this planet. Yeah. I just lurk a lot. Ugh, I feel that. I feel that. I do a lot of lurking myself. I can't. Oh, we did get a level up? Hell yeah. I didn't even notice. I heard it, but I didn't register. The, <laughs> the closest I can get to interaction. Boop! <laughs> Thank you for that boop. Alright, uh, let's see. So I got- oh, that's right. I want my decryption up so we can open anything. Now I'm gonna do this so we can get healing up. Oh, that's right, I can't level up the others right now. You need to figure out your channel point rewards. Yeah, I... There's a lot you can do with it, and it can be really hard to figure out what you want to do. Oh, what's this? Wait. I've definitely taken a lot of stuff uh, from other streamers, <laughs> which is totally fine. system. I mean, obviously you're a little, like, you can't do some of this stuff because no computer, but I mean, the, the thing that, like, I, just off the top of my head, I mean, you could do voices or Some people have points uh, for like howling or barking or... That's not really my kind of thing, but you know, if, if it's your thing. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It took me a long time to fill out my points, honestly. There's a lot of stuff we, we definitely tried and then never did again. <laughs> Nothing set up, honestly. Yeah, and some streamers are like that, too. There's there's nothing wrong with having nothing set up. <laughs> Point redemption where you tell a pun. See, that's good. That's really good. <laughs> For that, you definitely have to be a pun master, though. <laughs> you gotta be prepared at all moments to whip out a nasty pun. <laughs> uh, let's go over here. Have it so my Discord has an entire channel where people can share dumb jokes and I'll read them on stream. Oh, that's really good, actually. Oh yeah, that's that's a really good idea. I think I'm too lazy to do that myself, but... <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh god. That car... The car... 
There's like this car that keeps driving around. It keeps stopping in the same place. And this is like the fourth time it has driven around. I'm so confused. Maybe they lost their dog or something and they're looking for their dog. I don't know. But right now I'm waiting till I move to get back to regular streaming. Oh yeah, that's totally fair. Thank you for the lurk. Enjoy. Force Prinny to be nice to himself because I have negative self-esteem. Oh <laughs> no, Prinny. That is good though. Prinny, you're wonderful. And then we have Pikachu dance. Pika, 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 P. You know what I need to add to this actually is like maybe I can do some voice lines of like, like Pikachu, Pika, 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 P, Pika, or something. Or I can take fucking shit from the anime. I don't know. I should add that over that though. I, I'm like, oh wait, because my community kicks so much ass, the nice button redeem. It's used the most. <laughs> That's so sweet. I'm like a four out of ten on my best days. Oh no. No. <laughs> oh. I'm glad you have that. That's that's fantastic. Also some other things need to be get fixed. Oh yeah. Like what? Ugh, I'm not gonna get Oh, but it looks like it's up there. Okay, well, I guess I have to go around here anyway. At least I think it is. It seems like it is. Ah! Hmm. This is gonna be interesting. Like, a big thing holding up some stuff is I'm waiting for a guy to send me a 360. Oh! Oh, you're getting a new 360? Gotcha. Oh, there's a base here. Not sure for what, but... Whoa. I'm here to, uh, I don't know what I'm here to do, actually. <laughs> Kick ass? I don't know. Yeah. I'm kind of surprised I already have, like, level four fucking weapons, but that's probably because, um, the new legendary fucking leveling system. I have way more points than I thought I would ever have in my life. I'm already level 14, like, <laughs> and I haven't done shit. I I've barely touched the story. Looks like you're stayed. Adrenaline. Let's get that. Oh, the guy's very busy. Oh, that sucks. What was I doing? Oh, that's right. God, we got a lot of shit. Melt some of it down real quick. Whoa, look at this. Holy fuck. Ooh. Uh, I'll take the tsunami. Oh, getting a phone call. Scam likely. All right. Um... Oh, I have- okay. That's fine. Oh, bless you, Smokey. 
for context, this guy runs a Discord server with about 40k people in it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just, uh, that's understandable. This is the shotgun. Put myself first. Tana. Oh, these are these are good. Get rid of the hurricane. I gotta equip myself with the best shit first. I'll just I'll just keep the stinger. Oh, she only has the Kessler. Jesus Christ! Yeah, she needs she needs that bad. Uh, I don't think I'm going to equip him with that. He has the Reaper 3 right now. I have the Reaper 5 or something. These aren't the best. This one sucks. Striker. I don't think I'm going to equip any snipers. Uh, we have blue wire tool, which is the basic, so I can get rid of that. And all this armor sucks, alright. Time for multitasking, woo! And with the 360, I currently have the disc lasers going out. Right, right. Yeah, and I'm sure that it's just... Oh. Easier to get a, uh, just a 360 versus uh, changing out the hard drive. Seeing as the 360 is still pretty pretty easy to find. Fire in the hole. Hmm. So it seems uh the Geth have been here. I almost shot you, Garrus. <laughs> it's not a red ring. Oh, okay. It's the, what, Falcon chipset or whatever? Falcon motherboard. I can't remember if it was the chipset or the motherboard. Three sixties. God. Oh, there's more behind us. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what are you guys shooting at? Shit. Oh, the other door opened. Okay. Tana Striker. The 360 teardown on iFixit is it rated extremely difficult. Oh, really? Oh, shit. Okay, I didn't know that. Yeah, fuck that then. <laughs> Just get a new one. Fuck it. I'm, man, I wonder why that is. I need to watch videos on it. I find that interesting. I've watched people replace the disk drive on like a fat PS3 before. And it seemed 
all right to do. Over there. What? Yes. Oh, yes. Great. <laughs> what was that? Whoa! Holy shit, okay. Okay, there's there's a lot here. Is that- that must be the destroyer's noise. Oh, that's Garrus, I'm sorry. Okay, let me switch weapons. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Ooh, no, that's not good. Three shot burst, I like it. Ow! What the fuck hit me there? I took out like all my shields. Might have been a Geth sniper. Yes, it is. Is dead, but that's okay. Cheesy, how are you doing? Uh, so with the 360, you can replace the CD drive, but you have to replace the motherboard as well. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Oh, the disk drive and motherboard are paired. Fuck, I didn't know that. Okay. Yeah, definitely fuck that. <laughs> That's really shitty. But they probably did it for pirate protection or something. Snipers on Insanity one-shot you if you're wearing light armor? Oh my god! <laughs> I'm sure uh, you know that from experience then. <laughs> Damn! Alright then. Oh, hello. Great. There was something behind me. Oh, there's one, there was one under me. Strange. Okay. I expect oh. one of these outposts to be the main base of operations for this incursion. One moment. This receiver appears to be picking up some kind of transmission. Based on the signal strength, I would say it's coming from inside this star cluster. Mm. It must be a message from the primary Geth base. We can use the signal to lock onto its location and take them out. All right. Good to know. Where's my uh? Oh, it's over here. Just finished up a Novaria last night. Rachni are still terrifying. Mostly the noises they make. Yeah, I'm not looking forward to that. <laughs> that'll be uh, that'll be interesting. It's one of the many dumb things Microsoft did to the 360. There's probably a modern vi vintage uh, gamer. Um, video on it, honestly. <laughs> it's funny, I love watching the modern vintage gamer videos about piracy and stuff. He goes so in-depth on, like, 
how they're able to crack things or how things work, etc. It makes no fucking sense to me. He's spitting all this code and language that I don't know, but I still watch it because fuck, I love it. <laughs> I love video games so goddamn much. And the consoles they're on. I just want to know everything, even if I don't understand. Anomaly! Let's go check it out. So let me save. PS3 had some issues with randomly ejecting discs. See, I had no idea that was a thing until much later. Um, Cause I mean, well, I, I didn't really know anyone with a PS3 because they were so goddamn expensive. Initially. Um, I knew one person with a PS3, but they had a... A fat PS3? And I believe the disc reader on that probably went out. So who knows what happened to that. Or no, I'm thinking of PS2. I actually don't know if I knew anyone with a PS3. I probably did, but... They were probably just playing their single-player games and not, like, Call of Duty that all the other boys were playing. That was interesting. The PS3, maybe the fat PS3, some of them also had overheating issues. I know the Slims did, uh, seeing as my Slim has overheated at least once. And then same with the PS4. But that's honestly to be expected from a Slim console, where there's not much room for airflow. Wait, what? Was I not just here? No? Okay. I don't know, I might have just- Yeah, because this is open. I was just here. I just got turned around, I guess. I guess I went in a circle. I don't I don't really know what happened. There's another Geth ship outside though. It's just uh sitting there. Interesting. Engine debris. Wait. Oh, I'm not on the- okay, yeah, I am exactly where I was before. I'm not on the point that I wanted to be. <laughs> Whoops! Excuse me, Geth ship. Have a good day. I got myself so turned around. I jumped off and then I climbed all the way back up. Mako, you squirrely bitch. <laughs> it's any sort of bump. <laughs> it's too bad I can't uh, analyze this stuff inside the Mako and I have to get out. 
God, I how much money do I have? Is there any way I can see main menu options equipment? I have nineteen. Wait, I've almost almost got two hundred thousand credits. Good as new. Didn't mean to do that, but all right. No thresher ma, I hope. Now that's everything on this planet. There's also the issue with uh, switches. I don't know if it's still an issue with the like newer models, but switches would start to bend if they were in their um, dock for too long, I guess, and they were on for too long. So they were getting too hot and they were bending. I still haven't had that and I have a Gen 1 switch. So I guess I'm just lucky in that regard. However, all of my fucking Switch controllers uh, drift. <laughs> Every single goddamn one. Even the fucking third party bullshit I have for the Switch fucking drifts. I hate it. Absolutely hate it. Oh, speaking of hating Nintendo, Oh, is this new? This might be new. Um, <laughs> people are really upset because they announced the new amiibo for um, Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. And it looks really cool. I would love to have it, but I'm probably not going to fucking be able to get it. It's probably going to be scalped to hell, as usual. Um, but I guess it has the ability to... Um, instantly travel from the sky to the ground, which is something you can only do at uh, save points in the game, normally. So the amiibo has the ability just to do that instantly, even from a dungeon, I guess, which is a really nice feature, but it's locked behind the amiibo. So people are really upset. <laughs> which is totally understandable, honestly. Locking something like that behind an amiibo, most people aren't going to get their hands on. Sucks ass. Joy-Con, uh, with the lock stuck open? Oh. Huh. So, what does that mean? Does that mean that when you attach it to your Switch, it, uh, doesn't register it as attached? I'm gonna go over here. Smokey, do you have to do that right now? Huh? Do you have to lick the box? Do you have to eat the box? No, you don't. Oh, it doesn't hold in. Oh, okay. I see what you said. I see. Full system. Some full power. power. Mr. Squishy, thank you for the follow. here. So I believe this is the... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Damn it! <laughs> Fuck! Um, that was the Geth base. I'm pretty...
It happens. Fucking happens. I wish I could skip this sequence. Alright, now I gotta travel over there again. God damn it. And probably fight those geth again. Not that that's an issue, but. Oh my god. Mako, please. <laughs> cool! It's raining, it's raining fire! fire. <gasps> Pretty off time, just subscribed. Aww. Paying for the gift they got from. I don't care, Bear. He's gifting one tier sub. Oh, thank you! <laughs> thank you so much, Pretty. I appreciate it. Fen, enjoy your sub. <laughs> wow! <laughs> How's the remaster treating you? Very well, honestly. Um, I haven't had really any issues so far. There's just been, uh, like, visual bugs, but, you know, that's to be expected of Mass Effect 1. Uh, honestly, it's been fucking fantastic. I love this game. <laughs> It's so nice to be playing it again, finally. And thank you again, Prinny. That was super nice of you. Oh, there's stalkers in here, great. Oh, hello. Okay, you're just coming on in. Destroyers in here. <laughs> I mean, I guess it is their base. Is combat significantly different? Uh, it is a lot tighter than it used to be. Like, for example, um, the fucking sniper rifle. It's not like constantly moving around, it's just dead. Dead center, all the time, which is awesome. It is a lot cleaner than it used to be. Okay. As the last geth falls, you hear music from across the room. On the monitor, a quarian stands before a hushed crowd. Warbling a mournful, a, wait, warbling a mournful a cappella of worlds. I know. And innocence lost. The recorded song is dispatched to the Geth worlds behind the Perseus veil. The transmitter shuts down. Okay then. Huh. All right. Whoa! It's raining fire. Oh, there's that done. Some rounds. A number of encrypted geth data files. In the proper hands, they could reveal much about the evolution of the geths since the, since the ban banishment of the Corians. From the Corians, or whatever. Ooh, boy. Uh. Oh god, yeah, that- so I brought this up when this first came out, but I would love to see, um, like, if the next- the new Mass Effect game that they're making, if they mostly focus on the Geth and the Corians, um, that'd be really fucking cool. I don't think it's gonna happen, however, though, because technically, if they go with the canon ending, which is, what, the, the destroy ending? then um, the Geth are probably all gone. <laughs> uh, so probably won't have a chance at that, but I, I find them to be the most interesting of the species. Like, I do really like the Turians, but the Turians are basically just a military s society. Not too interesting, to be honest. And then we've gone deep into the... Uh, what are they called? 
whatever Rex is. The Krogans. Yeah, I, you know, I wonder if we'll actually see anything uh, this E3 about the new Mass Effect. If they'll drop, like, another teaser or something. Because there's no way they're going to show us gameplay already. I don't think it's uh, quite there. I think the only thing that we know about it right now is that Liara is still around, I think. Or she's, yeah, I don't know, possibly around. <laughs> it can't be that long after Mass Effect 3 then. Yeah, I don't... I mean, we're not fully sure. Um, it could be. <laughs> and they were just playing like an audio recording of Liara or something. If if it w I can't remember if it was her talking. They do mention uh, a character who is tied to Liara, which I'm not going to spoil. <laughs> Cuz we'll come and we'll, 